DNA sources of spooky to remote and how long will they last? Hello everyone. In this video, we will tell you what can be used as DNA sources and how long they last. Firstly, nails can be used. The DNA contained in fingernails is encased in hard keratin, which protects it from degradation. Cut a piece of nail and cover it with paper masking tape. Then put it into your remote. Nail specimens may be best renewed each month. Saliva can also be used. Cut a strip of blank paper, blotting paper is best, about 2 inches long and 1 inch wide. Place the top one third of this in your mouth for a minute or until it becomes saturated with saliva. Then allow it to air dry for about 10 to 20 minutes before placing it into your remote. It should last for about 3 days. Buckle skin cells can also be used. This is how police do large-scale DNA testing after certain serious crimes. As above, use a strip of paper, but don't allow it to soak in your mouth. Instead, rub the top one-third gently, but firmly, against the inside of your cheek for a moment. If it becomes wet, allow it to air dry as above. This lasts for about four to five days. Blood is an excellent source of DNA. For this you need a pack of lancets designed for diabetics to safely test blood sugar levels. These are inexpensive and available from all pharmacies. Wash your hands thoroughly first, then follow the directions on the pack. Smear the droplet of blood on the top one third of a strip of paper. Allow to air dry for a few moments. The DNA keeps in good condition for about five to six days. Hair. Hair itself doesn't contain any DNA, but the hair root or bulb does, so it must have the root bulb attached. This keeps in good condition about a week. Okay, thanks for watching this video.